Hi, I'm Christian, and this is the fourth Christian burial of the day. Big Brother 15, Austin, you just got evicted. What happened? I, I'm, I'm shook right now. Um, I don't know what happened either. We were all in an alliance, and so, like, I just thought we had it. I thought we were going to... And then she said that um, I was talking about... Who's she? Savannah. Savannah was like, I heard my name being tossed around, so Austin, I'm going to choose you. When did I talk about her? I'm like, you can watch this show. You know I wasn't talking about her. But it is what it is, I guess. Well, first off, to, to let you feel comfortable, you can pick anything from here to cuddle with for the rest of this interview. Uh -huh. So you can pick, like... A whisk or I like that. Whiskey. This is very yeah. I don't know what that is. This but is we'll you go use it, it to juice stuff. Okay. I All think. right. So would you say you feel juiced right now after what just happened? Yeah, I do because we were in an alliance and we all voted to take out somebody, and then they all turned because it was a vote to eight to one. So I thought it was going to be close. I at least thought I was going to win. But no, the whole entire alliance turned on me. So. so, who is in this big alliance? Okay, so it's called the Sleepyheads because we spent the night here. And so it's basically, it's like over half the people in there. I'm the first person in the alliance to get out. So, that's a big deal. Um, it was Savannah, myself, Eric, Brandon, um, Olivia. So yeah, it was pretty big. And then Eric added, um, Hayden. So, all I want to know is who voted to have Aubrey out and, like, thank them. So, what do you one person on my side. What do you think pushed them to all of a sudden backdoor you? Um, I honestly have no clue. Um, it could have just been put down to everybody, on the, everybody else in the Alliance has met before yesterday. I was like the first person that doesn't really know anybody here. Okay. So, who do you think maybe is running the game right now? Who do you think is stirring the pot? Um, I had no clue because I thought I was in good standing. So, if I had to choose anybody, it would be Savannah. Just because she was HOH. Um, unless somebody else had something against me, but I, don't, I didn't think they did. But I've definitely, out of the people in the Alliance, Savannah was the one I talked to the least. Okay. So would you do anything differently if you could go back and, you know, play this game again? Would you do anything differently? I don't think so. I mean, I made it further than I thought I would, but I would love to have gone further. Because we still have a lot left to go. So I'm going to simmer it down a little bit. If you could be a cake... How many layers would you have? What would be the flavor? And what would be the icing? Um, I like red velvet cake. So I'd be a red velvet cake with um, whatever cream that is that's usually the icing. Like the white, cream cheese. The white cream? Or whatever. Yeah, yeah, that icing. And I would have uh, three layers. Three really big layers. Yeah. Sounds good. So I'm going to leave you the floor. This is a huge, you know, shocking moment. So I'm going to let you have the floor. You can roast anyone in there. You have all the freedom, you know. So what, what do you have to say? Um, I don't know. Just shocked. Let down. Um, very uh, surprised. Yeah, I don't have much to say. Okay. I'm at a loss of words. Speechless. Well, yeah. this has been the fourth Christian burial of the day, and I must say, is is the biggest blindside so far. It really is. Like, I had everybody had everything else figured out, so maybe everybody else knew that I was getting out. I, don't know. I didn't. That's for sure. Well, you played a great game. Thank I'm you. I'm sorry to see you go. Yep. But there were too many cooks in that house. Hmm. They could have taken somebody else out. This has been the Fourth Christian Burial. See you next time.